Spring is basically here, which means summer is coming up. So we all know what that means. It's time to spring clean and get my apartment looking right. The state of my living space right now is crazy and I do not know how I let it get this bad, but cleaning vlogs help me stay motivated. So I figured we could tackle this together. Whenever I'm in a tidy and organized space, I strive. So the goal is to make my apartment look spotless by the end of this video. I'm not going to lie. This is going to take me a while, probably even a few days, but it will be worth it. Now that that's been said, let's talk about the game plan. I think I want to tackle this room by room, section by section. So I'm going to start with my kitchen because it's the least messiest and work my way to my room because it's a disaster. Let's hop in and get to cleaning because if I don't do it now, it will just keep getting worse and no one wants to start spring with a messy space. I think the best way to do this spring cleaning is to tackle it by room because as we can see the state of my apartment is actually not okay it's embarrassing but I'm posting this because I want to be 100% real with you guys and most of the time my apartment is messy and I'm really trying to do better at staying organized and clean so let's tackle this we're gonna start with my kitchen because it's the least messiest thing and I think that's the best way to do this but before I even go to my kitchen I'm going to take my sheets off my bed and put them in the wash so that those could get clean while I'm cleaning the rest of my apartment because those desperately need to be cleaned and I feel like that's a good way to start off this little spring cleaning vlog. We're leaving this like this for now until my sheets get washed and are clean because I like using the same ones because I think they're so springy and girly and cute. I think my room is actually in the worst state it's ever been, especially because that's all my Christmas stuff still, but we're gonna ignore it until later because it's actually making me so stressed and I'm going to put these in the wash machine now. good right now but it's not gonna stay like this because whenever I start to clean I instantly start sweating profusely it always happens tell me if anyone could relate to this please but we're gonna tackle the kitchen now it's honestly not that bad compared to the state of my room and everywhere else in my apartment but I just put my sheets in the wash machine so we're going to wait for those to get clean and go clean my counters clean my sink load the dishwasher and everything like that in the kitchen Thank you. 
The kitchen is cleaned, so I feel good about that. The sun is about to set, and I am getting very antsy about everything in my apartment. I just flipped over my laundry and put my sheets in the dryer, and now I'm just gonna fold some laundry, and then we are going to move on to the next part of the apartment, but I'm not sure what that's going to be yet. basically fell out but it's okay we're just gonna ignore that because it's gonna go up soon anyway because I'm sweating but I decided I'm going to continue on with my living room it is now dark outside so I'm using my light but I can't tell if the lighting's bad so if it is I'm sorry it's because it's nighttime out now and I'm not even close to done I don't know if this is gonna all be done today if I'm being honest because I'm exhausted and I'm trying to do room by room so I don't get stressed out because I like cleaning but I don't necessarily love deep cleaning but I like how it looks and feels after if that makes sense so we are going to tackle the living room honestly it's not that bad at all the only bad part that i like can't get over is my room and i don't even want to look at that right now so if i can get the living room and the bathroom done today and then just do my room tomorrow i'll be satisfied so that is the goal it's just one of those days feels like you're drifting away it's just one of those days feels like you're falling with the rain it's just one of those days is going pretty well I am going to dust now but the problem is I don't have the thing that attaches to this I think I threw it out that was an accident but I do have these so I'm just gonna use this and like use my hand I guess I feel like it should do the same thing and then after that the only other thing I have to do in the living room at least is vacuum so we're making good progress it actually worked really good to get all the dust off so I'm happy Everything is starting to come together. I'm very excited. I have a lot of candles on and they are actually matching and mixing very nicely together and my apartment smells so good. I wish you guys could smell it. I should clean my desk area now, but I'm not going to until tomorrow morning because my boyfriend's over. He's at the gym right now, but he's playing video games and I don't want to mess anything up because knowing me, I'll like be cleaning the desk and something will knock over and I don't want to mess anything up. So I'm going to do that part tomorrow, but I am going to clean this side of my apartment, which is basically kind of like the hall hallway to my living room but it's not really a hallway I don't know how to explain it but I have to clean the mirror and the table and stuff like that so I'm gonna clean that before I clean the bathroom just because it's giving me a lot of stress looking at it because I have a bag of laundry on the floor that I have to clean that was at my boyfriend's house and I didn't want to wash it there I could have I just thought it would be better to do it here so I brought that home I have a lot of like spring decor out room decor because I want to transform my room a little bit in a few weeks and I don't know there's just like a lot of clutter so I I want to get everything off the table so I can then clean the mirror, clean the table, and clean the floor surrounding that. And then we will finally get to the bathroom. I wake up, I don't want to make my bed. I'll save up all my energy instead. You take up all the energy I have inside. And I can't find a way to just ignore it. And I can't take it anymore cause I can't stop you from running around through my mind won't stop running ever will I'll take some melatonin pills this time cause I just want to sleep tonight yeah I just want to sleep I just finished doing out there and right now I am still drying my bed sheets, but I have this big bag of clothes that I have to wash. That's laundry from my boyfriend's house. So I'm gonna wash that and we're going to start on the bathroom. Found myself smiling more. 
Once you leave, I feel down again I talk to myself on the floor just to feel less alone I swear that I'm trying my best You tell me the stress shouldn't be a friend I wonder where I'll end up next on the corner of hope For a minute, I let you know when to let go. You give a little love with a little sun everywhere you go, everywhere you run. You never say a word, even when it hurts. Everywhere you go, everywhere you smile. You make it look easy. I don't understand how you can love me. apartment is really coming together the only thing I have left is my room I'm honestly probably not gonna get to all of it tonight but I am gonna do some of it I'm just exhausted so I'm definitely gonna put the sheets on my bed and then we'll kind of like play it by year I'm gonna try to do some of it and we'll see where we go I am gonna say right now I'm not doing my closet in this video my closet is a wreck and I'm making a whole other dedicated video to my closet because this video will be like an hour long if I don't so we're just gonna tackle my room and we're gonna take it step by step and maybe finish some of it tomorrow I'm so tired. I've been doing this for like 12 hours, but we're gonna keep going. We're gonna try to finish today. sleep but at least my bed is made it is the next day and when I tell you guys I literally passed out last night I was so tired I filmed that last clip I went to the bathroom to wash my face wash my face and was like I need to go to bed right now and literally passed out so we are finishing this video today I have my bed like already made the only thing I have to do is kind of just declutter everything and clean off the surfaces in my room which honestly shouldn't take that long and I feel very happy the only other thing that I wanted to do was get rid of all my Christmas stuff that is still in the corner of my room however I really need my mom's help with that because I can't lift it by myself so I'm gonna wait and just kind of leave that there and ignore it for now until she can come and help me and hopefully that'll be soon I just have to ask her but I'm going to probably text her in a little bit and just see if she can help me this coming week so that I'm not gonna touch just because it's already decluttered I just need to put it in my parents attic and all the other stuff other than my closet I just kind of have to declutter and dust off and wipe down the mirrors my closet as I mentioned I'm not even gonna touch because I'm gonna make a whole other video about that because it is way too cluttery and I think it'll be fun content as well to like separate it so let's go clean my room I feel like a bed being made really does make up like 50% of the room so this already looks better I'm going to work on my vanity now
We have finally reached the end of this video. I am so happy. I feel so refreshed. There's just something about spring cleaning that just makes me feel amazing. So I definitely recommend if you haven't tried it yet this year, definitely do it before spring actually comes because then it just sets you up for the right path, in my opinion, for spring. But with that being said, if you stayed up until this point of the video, comment a daisy emoji and I will see you guys really soon.